In the pest management industry, Norman Goldenberg is the equivalent of a five-tool Major League Baseball player. Like Willie Mays or Cal Ripken, throughout his distinguished career, Norman has done it all. I first met him in the mid-70s. He was a pest control operator out of Florida, and he was kind of fast-tracking in the pest control industry. He was you know, a very, very dynamic young individual who was uh, um, making a mark in, in, and uh, moving quickly into the leadership position of NPM. Okay. I've worked with Norman for uh, many years in the industry, and I can tell you that um, Norman has just been a terrific leader. You know, whether you're a lawn care operator, a landscape contractor, pest control professional, supplier, uh, Norman has led us to many successes in that area, successes that meant that we could do our jobs as designed without the encumbrance of undue government regulations. I met Norm at the first NPMA Pest World Conference, and it was probably 1980. Well, what I've always admired about Norman is that he is a straight shooter. He'll tell you exactly what he thinks. He's happy to have that conversation with you, and as long as you're upfront with him and, and uh, he, you know, he appreciates differing points of view, I think he's comfortable in his own skin, and that makes him an effective leader. When they first asked me to do this video, I just went right away back to my first board meeting with, with Planet. And I remember I was very, very nervous going into this uh, board meeting and my dad told me, he said, you know what, go in there and learn. These are the top of the industry people and you're going to just learn so much and allow it to be part of making you into the businesswoman or help you round out your career uh, in this industry. So, of course, here I am going into my first board meeting, nervous, and Norm Goldenberg is the first person that I bump into as I walk in through the door. And what does he do? He hugs me and yells out, welcome aboard, glad to have you on the ship. So, uh, from that moment on, Norm, I can honestly say it was love at first hug. He owned and operated a successful pest management business, Alert Lear Pest Control in Miami. He served with distinction as president of the National Pest Management Association. He had a successful second career at one of the industry's iconic corporate brands, Terminex. He represented the lawn care and pest management industries at both the state and national level with passion and integrity. One of the things that's always impressed me about Norman is that he has dedicated himself to successfully growing professional organizations. He's very active in committee work and he's very active in conference calls. When he agrees to be part of a board, he gives it all. I really want to thank you, Norm. You gave up so much of your personal home life uh, to do what you do um, and be so awesome. And I, uh, I really wanted to say thank you for that. Um, thank you from my heart and thank you for the from the industry. I mean, Norman is all about commitment. Norman is an individual who is driven, I believe, to make a difference. Very bright, very charismatic, um, not about ego, not about power. He's about contributing. There's always a handful of people in any industry that when the going gets tough, uh, leadership turns to. Norman's n never had such a strong ego that he needs to take credit for every accomplishment. He's just a very likable personality. Before being Planet President, he served many years as the Government Affairs Chair. He was our leader and he helped design the, the, um, the tactics through his advocacy, through his uh, industry experience, through his connections, through his ability to meet with people in industry and out of industry and including regulators and, and even folks from the other side, if you will, um, did a great job of guiding us through those, those waters. And um, he has a, a grace and a charm and a natural leadership ability that enables him to be successful. He represented the lawn care and pest management industries at both the state and national level with passion and integrity. And he accomplished all of this while nurturing hundreds of friendships and positively impacting thousands of lives, culminating in this honor today, the Planet Lifetime Achievement Award. You know, people may not fully appreciate or recognize the huge heart that Norman has. I think once you get to know him, you know that he's passionate about lots of things. He's got an enormous heart. 
he has a lot of integrity and he's he's willing to sacrifice himself for the greater good. One story that I have about Norm was uh, when I first really got to know him, his planet gives back in uh, 2012. And to show what kind of leader he was, he was out there in the pouring rain uh, doing work with about 40 other volunteers. And as I was making rounds to the different sites, I got to talk to Norm a little bit, and he's out there in the pouring rain and doing the thing just like everybody else. And I thought to myself, boy, this is pretty neat. You got a guy of his caliber and his uh, leadership skills out here with, with the other volunteers. And uh, after it, I was reflecting, and I went up and talked to him. And Norm, I said, Norm, I think that's great you did that. I appreciate you being here. And he said, uh, he said, Glenn, you know what? Part of leadership is showing up. And uh, that's true. Leadership is about showing up. And uh, Norm's done that for many years in this industry. And he's, he's shown up for many, many different things. And he's left a legacy for himself. So we appreciate it, Norm. Thank you, and uh, God bless. While I'm going to miss interacting with you on a regular basis, Norm, like all of the great ones, whether in sports or business, you'll never be forgotten. For what you've accomplished in both your personal and professional life, will surely stand the test of time, cementing your legacy as one of our industry's most talented and passionate advocates.